Good morning, boys and girls. It's Miss Davis. I'm coming to you today with our calendar time. Um, today is Thursday, April the second. Repeat. Today is Thursday, April the second. Well done. Let's go ahead and sing the days of the week song, and then I'm going to ask you some questions. Ready? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Today is Thursday. Today is Thursday. Today is Thursday all day. Today is Thursday. Today is Thursday. Today is Thursday all day. Okay, so if today is Thursday, what was yesterday? What was yesterday? If you said Wednesday, you are correct. Okay, if yesterday was Wednesday, today is Thursday, tomorrow will be, what will tomorrow be? If you said Friday, you are correct. Well done, tomorrow will be Friday and we have a very special six-year-old birthday tomorrow. It will be Kaylin's birthday tomorrow. Well done. Okay, we're gonna move over here to our weather. Our weather is very cloudy today. It is cloudy. So we're gonna put it on cloudy. And I checked the weather and it said the high, that means the hottest it's supposed to get today is 71. So I go to 70 and go to one mark over. So that's, it's, it's supposed to be warm today. Although it's a little windy, so I think that it might um, be cooler than we think. All right. I'm going to pull up morning message. Okay, we're going to write the short date. We're going to use four to represent the month of April. We're going to use two to represent the day because it's the second day of the month and 20 to represent the year. So our date is four slash two slash 20, okay? So whenever we start a sentence, we always start with a capital letter and we end with a stop mark. Uh, a stop mark can be a period, an exclamation point, or a question mark. Um, when we write our sentences, we use words to make up our sentence. We use letters to make up our words, and we have space between our words so that we know where the words start and stop. All right, I'm gonna start my sentence. We, I'm gonna put space. I ran out of room here, so I'm gonna go to the bottom and start a new line. We have our class. Meeting at 11. We have our class meeting at 11. Repeat, we have our class meeting at 11. Please bring uh oh something. Again, I ran out of room. I'm going to go to the bottom to show and tell. Please bring something to bring show. something to show and tell. So when we come to our meeting in a just little less than an hour, I want you to bring something to show and tell. 
All right, today is day four for our eggs. I'm gonna show you what day three looked like, which was yesterday. And then today is day four. What do you notice about the eggs? Are they the same? Have they changed? What's different? Yeah, so it looks like a little more blood veins have been added. There's darker red. So our um, eggs are growing and developing and in just three more days, we'll be able to candle the eggs and look inside. All right, boys and girls, bye.